I would challenge you to start looking for opportunities to give, to start looking for opportunities to do something bigger than you did in 2019, to do something better than you did in 2019. God given. It means possessed without question, as if by divine authority. In a world full of distraction, confusion, and uncertainty, how would it feel to possess without question? You know, people think that the, the, the greatest way of the enemy is temptation, but it's not. It's self-doubt. It's anxiety. It's, it's these things that are those thoughts in our head that keep us from doing what, what we ultimately could do by distracting us um, with all of these thoughts. And those thoughts will always be there yeah. uh, but it's it's learning not to pay any attention to them or it's learning also to equip yourself with different types of affirmations every limit you have is self-imposed every limit cool thing about it is every time you push yourself to that and and I would encourage beyond that limit that self-imposed limit it's a little bit further out little bit further out a little bit further out that's why I'm so big on setting goals every week and keeping yourself accountable through the week think about the habits of your life I'd like for you to just take a second and think about what are the bad habits that I've created what are some of those things that I do on a daily basis on a weekly basis that aren't serving me and instead of just thinking with the framework of, well, I'm going to stop doing that. I'd like for you to rewrap that framework with, I'm going to replace that thing with something else. Social media is an extremely powerful tool, not just in how you can put a message out there to the world, but how you can impact one person. I just don't scroll, just randomly scroll through, you know, Facebook and Instagram as much anymore because I'm constantly posting on Facebook and Instagram. Um, but I started to think about it, and and that's 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 life, right? That that's that's one of the keys to success. Period. Is the more you create, the less you consume. There's a big difference between pain and suffering. And I truly believe that having a relationship with God. Just inviting God to say, God, will you come in and have my back is the only thing that allows you to not suffer. That you're still going to experience pain, but that when you experience pain, it won't turn into suffering. And so I don't sit here and wish any of you to never go through pain. I hope you go through pain on a, on a regular basis, but I hope you never suffer. And I know that the only way that you can do that, that the only way that you can go through life and not suffer is by having someone have your back. Serving is providing a, a solution for a need, for providing a solution for a problem. Like when you give with no expectation, it enriches your life beyond anything. It's, it's almost like it draws more mm -hmm. of the resources to you.